Hey guys, Dan here. I'm with Michael from Olympus Arms. We ran into these guys here at SHOT Show and they told me about this product that seems like a game changer in the in like the precision world. Yeah, absolutely. And so I wanted to come down here and let Michael take it away and just give you a demo, talk through this gun, see what we got going on here. So Michael, if you'll great. take Dan, it Dan, I appreciate the opportunity. So my name is Michael Marino. I'm with Olympus Arms. This is our rifle. It is the Vulcan Recoilless Rifle and it lives up to its name. All right, so I'll show you how it works. So the thing about our rifle that's really, that's unique is that the barrel reciprocates the entire length of the operation into the receiver, right? So what that does is it turns the entire rifle into a shock absorber for recoil. It takes your recoil from a sharp spike in a fixed barrel gun to a very slow, gentle curve. Smooths it out over time and it's not distracting at all. You can keep both eyes open during the shot. You can very quickly shoot again or find a new target. So it looks a little bit like an AR-10 from the outside, okay? But the looks can be deceiving, I'll tell you that. All the magic is on the inside of the rifle. All right. If you notice, there is no rear takedown pin at all. What we do is we use a button here to shotgun the rifle much faster. Oh, wow, okay, yep. yeah. Then you have a front takedown pin, all right? So again, it starts to look a little bit like an AR with an upper and a lower, except that our upper comes apart in two pieces like this. That was fast. Like a two That's halves a of a pistol. I've done it about a thousand times now. All right, all Yeah. Right. So we have our own proprietary bolt carrier group all right, it's a straight pull bolt. We developed it ourselves. We have a non-reciprocating ambidextrous charge handle. You can hold this anywhere you want. It's not going to reciprocate. So and bite good you in for the lefties hand. too. Absolutely. So I tell people I was born left-handed and raised right-handed. So everything in my rifle is going to be ambidextrous. All right. All right. This is my favorite part of the rifle. You can change the barrel in this rifle in 60 seconds or less with no tools required. I'm going to show you how. All right. So I pull my spring forward. My tab comes out. And the barrel comes right out the back end of the rifle, just like this. It comes out the back end? Okay. Yep, exactly. So once I depress my springs, it comes out the back, and I can clean this barrel very easily, and then put it right back in. I could put in a longer or a shorter barrel, or even a different caliber if I choose to. So I can do a caliber change Fantastic. in the field, out of my backpack, whatever I want to do. Go from a short gun to a long gun. So it goes back in reverse order, just like that. Depress the spring. Tab goes back in. There you go. We just changed the barrel. That is insane. Hopefully someone caught the time on that one. All that right. That is insane. We'll put a timer up in the video. Perfect. I want to see it. So this is a adjustable muzzle brake, right? You notice we have no gas operation here at all. Yeah. Right? No gas piston, no gas impingement. This gun runs clean all the time. It's like a bolt gun in a sled that you're holding on to. Awesome. Okay? What we do is we have an adjustable muzzle brake here. So let's say that if I want the lightest recoil, I keep the brake on full open. Let's say it's early in the morning and it's cold and my ammo has less energy, I can choke down that muzzle brake to a half brake or close it off completely and then I have the most amount of energy. This is a universal muzzle device, it's patent pending. You can put a flash hider, a muzzle brake, a compensator, anything you want on here. So there you go, those are the upper parts. So it goes back together like the slides of a pistol. Hopefully I can get it back together as fast as I took it apart. All right. So then I'll show you the lower here, some unique features down here as well. So there's this little shelf in here. You see that little shelf that it's got in the lower? Yes. Okay, that is so that we can develop magwell inserts, right? So right now we're 762 by 51 P mag or Lancer. So I can put an insert in here and now shoot 762 by 39. Or if I want a pistol caliber, a nine mil, a 40, a 45. A I'm using nine this. mil with a non. Wow. That's right. So I've got it. Right. Now I'm using the same rifle. I put a blowback bolt in here and a nine mil magazine in and I'm shooting much less expensive ammo out of the same firearm, the same configuration that I'm gonna use at full power. Another thing that I'm really proud of is our patent pending bolt catch. Check this thing out. It is a parallel ambidextrous bolt catch. So it's an actual catch too, it's not just a release. That's right, so watch here. I can catch or release. Wow, So okay. I can push or pull. It operates in what I call 3D, which is either push-pull or 2D, 
where I just use the side of my finger here, okay. inside of the mag well, or inside of the mag or the trigger well. So if you look, it barely protrudes into the trigger well, just barely. So that if I'm in here and I'm about to squeeze the trigger, if I haven't released the bolt, I'll know. Wait a second, click. Now I can fire. Awesome. Everything about the rifle is designed to be done while maintaining cheek to stock weld. I never have to break cheek to stock weld to do anything in this rifle. If you look in here, there is no buffer and no buffer tube in here. Right. I can make a folding stock version of this that you can shoot with the stock <laughs> folded. I've got a 12 inch barrel pistol version that has just a nut on the end and nothing for the tube. All right. So we took everything about the guns we loved, we put it all together into one and made one super weapon that we love to shoot. So I'll show you here. It's all back together. Maintain cheek to stock weld. Charge, lock the bolt, release, fire. So if I charge, awesome. let's say I, I'm on my last round and the bolt locks open, drop the mag, new mag, release, fire. Just like that. Weighs less than eight pounds, has less felt recoil let's than an this. AR-15. That is not bad at all. Yeah. For, nice for and balanced, nice rifle. and light. And uh, the guys on the on the bus were talking about the accuracy of this thing. So it's still putting rounds on rounds, correct me if I'm wrong. Obviously, ammo dependent. Of but. course, of course. So we have a couple different versions. This version is the two MOA version. All right, and the purpose is that we get high reliability even in dirty and dusty conditions. So it runs two MOA, which is comparable to your AR series. Uh, but we have an accurized version where we put a bushing in the trunnion and around the barrel. So it makes a very tight seal, less than a 1,000 seal, and it maintains accuracy during the shot. That one's more of the match grade version, more of the precision version. What we really enjoy about this is what we call successive shot accuracy. Like anyone can take the first shot, my wife says. It's the second shot that matters. How Good quickly point. can you put the next shot on target? We say that in the pistol world too. You know, there anybody you go. can put a shot where you want. It's recoil management. That's right, it's the next shot. So we've had people shoot this. My wife can shoot the standing offhand, 308. And that is really unique. Uh, we've had we had one guy at the range would shoot two shots as fast as he could and hit the target with both shots. And another guy held a C grip and knocked down five targets, bang, 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 all the way across the range as fast as he could. So is this is going to change firepower from now on. Awesome. I am really looking forward to seeing this become more prevalent. I have a feeling this is going to take off pretty big. This, I'm, this is a new product. Right? Brand new Brand this new. year. That's Brand right. new this year. Yeah. Uh, honored to be here and get to see this and uh hopefully get it some uh visualization out there uh the guys on the bus i gotta say they talked it up but they did not go into as much depth and detail absolutely this thing is awesome Thank i am so i much. am looking forward to hopefully get my hands on one of these at some point there's a lot of innovation in this that i'm just really appreciating that so those of you that are familiar with the ar-15 platform even ambidextrous often only a release not a catch so i got a full on catch um no gas guys no gas face runs clean no gas face like adjustable compensator that's phenomenal man like stockless you can run what you can probably put a law folder on here if you that's what to. we do we've and got it on that version right there got a law folder like so many cool innovations to this fully fully ambidextrous so i am very pleased thank you for taking some time Damn, to talk so to me. much uh and guys you know be sure to look out for olympus arms Looks like they're doing some phenomenal stuff coming out. Uh, so be sure to check them out. Do you guys have a website? Yeah, we're a little bit behind. So okay. our website will be live the day after SHOT Show. Okay. Uh, right now we're just releasing. And you know, people have a lot of doubts about the recoil reduction in here. And I just tell people shooting is believing. You got to pick one up, you got to shoot it, and then you'll know the answer. Fantastic. All right, Mike, thank you very much. Dan, thanks so much. Everyone else, stay safe, stay smart, stay tactical. There you go.